Just speak to mother, then be gone. You have an army of darkspawn to avoid and would be best to get an early start. I will stay and make something to eat. I'll get on. Here is your fellow Grey Warden. You worry too much, young man. You... you're alive. <laughs> I thought you were dead for sure. Artificial fear. Duncan's dead. The Grey Wardens. Even the King. They're all... dead. Oh, this doesn't seem real. Work from our mother. We'd be dead on top of that tower. Do not talk about me as if I am not present, lad. I, I didn't mean. But, but what do we call you? You, ne you never told us your name. Names are pretty, but useless. The chasing folk call me Fleming. I suppose it will do it. Me? Fleming? From the legends? Zarath was right. You are the witch of the wilds, aren't you? And what does that mean? I know a bit of magic, and it has served you both well, has it not? Well, we cannot have all the Grey Wardens dying at once, can we? Someone has to deal with these dark spawns. It has always been the Grey Wardens' duty to unite the lands against the Blights. Or did that change when I wasn't thinking? If you think small numbers make you helpless, you are already defeated. But we were fighting the Dark Spawn. The King had nearly defeated them. Why would Logan do this? Now that is a good question. Men's hearts hold shadow of dark and Perhaps he believes the Blight is an army he can outmaneuver. Perhaps he does not see that the evil behind it. The Archdemon. It is said that long ago, the Maker sent the old gods of the ancient to Vinter Imperium to slumber in prisons deep beneath the surface. An archdemon is an old god awakened and tainted by dark spawn. Believe that or not, history says it's a fearsome and immortal thing, and only fools ignore history. The bone? It seems that he would be the first king to gain his throne that way. Grow up, boy. If our demon knew what he did, he would never stand for it. The Landsley would never stand for it. There would be civil war. I suppose. If our demon wasn't a boss to die, he still has all his men. And he was Caelan's uncle. I know him. He's a good man, respected in the Landsman. Of course! We could go to Redcliffe and appeal to him for help! You have more at your disposal than merely old friends. Of course! The truth is, Grey Wardens can demand aid from dwarves, elves, mages, and other places. They are obligated to help us during a fight. I may be old, but dwarves, elves, mages, this army, and who knows what else. This sounds like an army to me. So can we do this? Go to Redcliffe and these other places and build an army? <laughs> and when is it ever? It's always been the Grey Warden's duty to stand against the Blight. And right now, we're the Grey Wardens. 
So you are set then, ready to be Grey Warden. Well, don't expect me to do everything. There is, however, one more thing I can offer you. The stew is bubbling, Mother dear. Shall we have two guests for the eve, or none? The Grey Wardens are leaving shortly, girl. And you will be joining them. Such a shame. What? You heard me, girl. The last time I looked, you had ears. Ha <laughs> ha! Her magic will be useful. Even better, she knows the wilds and how to get past the horde. Have I no say in this? You have been itching to get out of the wilds for years. Here is your chance. As for you, Wardens, consider this repayment for your life. Not to look a gift horse in the mouth, but won't this add to my problems? Out of the wilds, she's an apostate. If you do not wish help from us illegal mages, young man, perhaps I should have left you on that tower. This is not how I wanted this. I'm not even ready. You must be ready. Alone, these two must unite for Elden against the Dark Spawn. They need you, Lord. Without you, they will surely fail, and all will perish under the blood. And you, Warden, do you understand? I give you that which I value above all in this world. I do this because you must succeed. Allow me to get my things, if you please. I am at your disposal, Grey Yes, it is. North of the Wilds is our first destination. It's not far, and you will find much in Or, if you prefer, I can take you in your silence. Yes, it is. Ah, uh -huh. ah, you will regret saying that. Sweet, sweet mother, you are so kind to cast me out of this. How fond you are of this event. Well, I always say, if you want something done, do it yourself. I knew about it when they gave it to us. I just... Do you really want to take her along with us, her mother says so? I guess you're right. The Grey Wardens have always taken her eyes for I am so pleased to have your approval. I may have answers. Ask. From time to time, I have been to the village I mentioned, watched its people, and pondered what curious beings they are. On occasion, I purchased goods from the village merchants. There I spoke with men a little. There they stared and knew me as an outsider. Mother wishes for me to expand the horizon of my experience beyond the wilds. Even she was not born here. It was she who raised me, and thus I consider her my mother, born from her womb or not. It is what you meant, yes? Young, married, pregnant? Who said she was any of these things? I certainly did not. It is a small place of little consequence called Lothering. No more than a stop along your Imperial Highway, where travelers purchase goods from local farms and smiths. I would go more often were it not for the town's chantry. It makes the village particularly intolerant and unpleasant for a stranger such as me. A chantry? And they never in all this time thought that... They even called out their Templars once. They found it. I mention it for its tavern, where travellers gather with news from other places. It is small enough that our appearance might go unnoticed. Beyond that, it is close. I know it. The real question is how we are going to get your friend past the Darkspawn, is it not? That's true. We can sense the Darkspawn. Conversely, they can sense us. 
We should be able to sneak past smaller groups, but larger ones, or particularly intelligent dark spawn, will always Mother has given me something else for them to smell instead as we pass by. It is important we head out of the wilds, however, not farther in. They come from underground, like an eruption. They broke through deep within the forest, and that is where they will be most concentrated. I know a few spells, though I am nowhere near as powerful as Mother. I have also studied history and your Grey Warden treaties. Can you cook? I can cook? Yes. Right, my cooking will kill us. That's all I know. I also know at least 15 different poisons that grow right here in this marsh. Not that I would suggest it is at all related to cooking. Farewell, Mother. Do not forget the stew on the fire. I would hate to return to a burned-down hut. Oh, it is far more likely you will return to see this entire area, along with my hut, swallowed up by the blight. I... All I meant was... Yes, I know. Do try to have fun, dear. 